Hello, welcome to Campervan Parts UK. I'm going to talk to you about thermal window screens. There are a number of different companies out there offering the thermal window screens, but the biggest selling point for what we're offering is this is our own product. It's made by the manufacturer directly for us to our own templates. The uh, Thermal screen is suckered onto the glass by way of a sucker. The sucker is something, again, we worked with the manufacturer to change and alter the sucker which is used. We are now using a deeper dish sucker to try and give a better adhesion to the glass. The sucker will only stick so well to the glass uh, depending on how well the glass is cleaned um, and also onto the shape of the sucker. But having said that, if the sucker does become misshapen, it's very, very easy to rectify this just by popping them into some warm water and then sticking them onto the glass while they regain their shape. The suckers are put through the eyelet on the thermal screen uh, on the silver side facing outwards. This is the side that gets stuck facing out of the vehicle in order to work as a reflective thermal screen, uh, getting the heat in the summer out. But obviously with the thermal insulation, it helps keep the, the heat in during winter. This one here you can see is a tailgate screen uh, and it has a cutout at the bottom for the wiper box. Although our blackout curtains have become very popular, in recent years. Uh, they work very, very well. They give you a complete blackout. They're permanently attached to the vehicle and they obviously close and open very, very easily and clip back out of the way. Some customers, often with combi vans, don't necessarily want curtains fitted to the vehicle for all the time that it's not being used as a camper van. Having said that, the thermal screens do work both with and without the curtains. So there are a number of customers who will go for blackout curtains in the back of their vehicle for summer use. And they will also have a set of thermal screens which which they will use in the winter, which they'll actually use behind the curtains and they'll actually use the curtains to make sure that they stay in place and they obviously then don't have to worry about how clean the glass is and making sure that the suckers have properly adhered because the curtains themselves keep the screens in place and they work, as I said, very well both in summer and in winter. So whether you're interested in a full set of thermal screens for the rear of your vehicle as well as the cab of your vehicle or if you are using blackout curtains in the back of the vehicle, let me show you the cab set. So this is the cab set for the VW T5, T6 and T6.1 Transporter. These are made specifically for that vehicle um, and is to our own uh, specification along with the oversized bag that we specify so that if you do end up with a full set of thermal screens, they can all be accommodated within this bag. So the screens themselves come with a three-piece set for the driver and passenger door. As said, this is tailored to properly fit the VW Transporter door. It's not a generic screen as with a lot of thermal screens. So they are manufactured to suit a Vito, a Vivaro, a Renault Traffic, a Ford Custom. They just, they, they, they're made with enough tolerance that they will roughly fit enough vehicles that they can then be sold to a number of different vehicles. These are vehicle specific. So they are made to be the correct shape and size for the transporter and give as best of a blackout as possible. The biggest selling point for our thermal screens over our competitors is the fact that the cab set has been made with these top tabs. The real bonus with these top tabs is it means that you unclip your sun visor, the tab can go underneath the sun visor and the sun visor can be clipped back into place. So the bonus with this is that although we do have the place for the uh, suckers to be fitted over the whole of the cab set. It does mean that if you want to fit the cab set by way of the top tabs and not use any of the suckers, you can, which means that you don't get rings on your window the following day from where the screen's been fitted. It also means that by clipping them under the sun visors, they can't fall down in the night. The side screens, although we do have on here, there is three places for um, the thermal screens to be, uh, to be fitted by way of suckers. You do only just need the top tab in order to fit it into place um, because by the time you close the front doors, that again holds it in place. 
So whether using the uh, thermal cab set with a full set of thermal screens or whether using them just on their own and using a different product for the back of your vehicle like curtains or other blinds and things that are available, I fully advocate these. They are brilliant. They work really, really well, both for winter use, for keeping the heat in during the winter, but they also help keep the heat out during the summer. So they work well, not just for nighttime use, but they're really, really good for using during the daytime. If you were going to a beach car park and leaving your vehicle in the sun during the daytime, obviously the thermal screen can be used in the windscreen of your vehicle during the daytime to keep the heat out. This is, as I said, our own product. There isn't anybody else supplying this. This is ours, only supplied by us using the tabs and things so that it can be fitted without the use of suckers for the windscreen. It's a very, very good product. I highly recommend it.